But most of our math is our algebra, our calculus, all of those things are generated through this circumstance, which also led into why one times one, you know, could not possibly equal one, because what if you made each side of those lengths one, then you couldn't get the proper hypotenuse. The problem starts when we try to make all shapes follow the same rules, like when we can't get the right length for the longest side of a triangle. This issue is a big deal in the study of shapes because it shows us that even the most perfect shapes are really just average forms. Euclid was an old-time Greek math expert who was good at studying shapes and thinking logically. He went to Egypt and wrote down important rules about shapes, which was a big step forward for math. But over time, some people changed his ideas or said he did things he didn't. Even with these mix-ups, Euclid's smart thoughts, like his study of a shape with 12 sides called the dodecahedron, have lasted a long time. This shows how strong and important his way of thinking about shapes still is in math talks today.